Thank you to the Patreons for funding this extra video and helping me create more content. So hello fellow engineers, welcome to Islanders. So after my Dwarf Romantic series, a lot of people suggested I need to play Islanders. Apparently it's very similar, but a bit different. So let's have a go. New game. Right, so this is our first island. Uh, <laughs> the game hasn't actually told me what I need to do. I assume I need to press this plus button. Ooh, so I can be a lumber pack, not jack. Oh no, I pick one, I pick one. So do I want to cut wood or do I want to farm some fields? Let's do some farming. Uh, game, not going to lie, your tutorial <laughs> is bare minimum. <laughs> right, let's put a field there. Oh, another field and one of them. Nice, I got some points. All right, so the next thing anyone wants on their perfect island is a brewing pack. We want to make some beer. Gonna squeeze a brewery in there, add a hop field, and then these are our normal fields. Oh god, we haven't done this very well. <laughs> uh, I am a child. I am a child. Game over. Um, <laughs> what the hell just happened? Okay, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go learn the game, and then I'll come back. Okay, so welcome to Islanders. So we'll start with the farming pack, I think. And then our level has a lovely bridge. It is broken, but it's still quite nice looking. So you can see the two buildings we can put down. Well, I say buildings. This one's a field. So this has a base score of three, but it gets extra bonus points depending on what's in range. So obviously this map is fresh. The only thing on there is a statue, which is this thing up here. So if we put our field over here, you see we get an extra five points, a total of eight points because that statue's in range. So we'll do that. Same with the other field. And then this is a mill, so we should get lots of extra points if we put this up here. Yes, 21 in total. So if you look on the bottom left, you can see our score. Every sort of round, we've got to hit a number. So we need two more points to get to 20 points. Thankfully, putting this down gets us 21 points. So that is fine. Can you see the points going in? So now our next score to beat is 70. And that's with a new pack. we got a plus button here, so we can click on that. So we can pick either the brewing pack or the lumber pack. I think we've got some trees down here, so I'm going to go with the lumber pack. So looking at this, we've just got to get 31 points out of these six buildings that we put down. So looking at these two buildings, there's no bonus for a field. So I'll grab these fields and I'm going to shove them up here. I can rotate these so I can sort of line them up a bit better. Because I think space saving is the key. I haven't done this very well <laughs> looking at it. So we've hit our 70 points already. We've still got two buildings left. So if we're not sure where we want to put these yet, we can just add some more. And what we're we going to do, we're going to do, we're going to do a city pack, I think. I think for our city, we're probably going to have that up here on this little plateau. Because city pieces, they generally only affect each other. So there's our city up there looking over everything. It's got a nice beach on it. They are a bit stranded, actually. I've just realized there's no bridge to the, to the fields and farms. So uh, they're going to have to launch their food across the bridge if they want to get fed. All right, so city center. It actually only gets 15 points if it's in the city, but it gets a massive 22 if it's over here. Can I put it in a position where it covers both? No. So if I'd built if I'd built these city buildings on this edge, I could have put this here and it could have been in range of both, and that would have been awesome. But no, I cocked it. So I'm just going to put that on the bridge, I think. So this house, I can either have up here where it only gets one point, or down here it gets 11 because it's in range of the city center and the statue. So I'm going to do that. So it looks like these lumberjack ones, if they're in range of another lumberjack, they get minus six. So I sort of want to like spread them out, I think. So obviously the more trees it's in range of is good. But if they're going to be in range of each other, it's bad. So we'll just see the sawmill. I think they just want to be in range of the lumberjacks. So I'm sort of thinking, is there a position where I can get all the trees? Or maybe most of the trees, but not each other. I'm going to put that there. I'm going to put one there, and then one there. That's seven points. And then this sawmill. I'm going to shove that in the middle, so that covers all three lumberjacks. So that's 21 points. Nice. And then as I went up a level, I can select a new pack. But I think we need some beer. Like, it's not really a decent island to live if you've got no beer. So let's do the brewing pack. Oh, so we've got more mansions. So I could just add these with the other mansions. Got a house. I remember houses being quite good over here. Yeah, 12 points. So we got to fit a house in somehow. Some house. Get it? 
Right, and then we got all of our brewing stuff. So the brewery wants to be in range of hop fields, and hop fields want to be in range of a brewery. So, <laughs> so that's going to work out well. So it looks like you get a standard five points for a hop field. So what I might do, I might have a little <laughs> a beer brewing area on the beach. Because I think that sounds idyllic, if I'm honest. Ooh, and looking at the bottom right, I've unlocked a new island. You collect enough points to unlock the button below. I wonder what happens when you press it. <gasps> so do I. Should I press it? I can do the plus or the island. I'm going to do the island. Oh, fill this with points to travel to a new island. Do I want to travel to a new island? I kind of want to keep my island going. We'll do that in a bit. We'll carry on. Let's do a shaman. So I think that's what we had going on before. So we can do more mansions up here. Can we squeeze a house in here somewhere? Falls. No. We can get one there though. That's seven points. And it looks like the best spot for this one. Oh, we could put it over here actually. 21 big ones. Oh, 24! Nice. And that's because it had loads of flowers in range. We need nine points from our remaining field. I don't think we're going to do it. I think the only place for it is up here. But there's actually no space. Bollocks. I think that's the end. That's the end. Right, sod it. I'm going to click next island. Let's see what happens. Oh, look. You'll continue on a mysterious new island. There's no way to return to your current island, but you keep your score. I might have just found a way out. Let's go. Oh, legend. <laughs> Okay, that's good. That's like a get out of jail free card, that. So what pack do we want? A farming pack or a seaweed? Let's try some seaweed. I haven't done any seaweed yet. So seaweeds are just seaweeds, basically. Okay. So you get minus one just for putting one down. Damn. Put that there. So I, I get a plus one for being in range. That's good. And then our seaweed little thing can go on there. Oh, no, we failed. I didn't get enough points. Oh, <laughs> no. All right, let's do another game. I think I know what's going on a bit more now. Here we go. Here we go. We've got a fully complete bridge. That can only be a good omen. We're doing lumber pack. Because so I can see some trees about. To so do one there. One there. And then our sawmill sort of there. Lovely. And this one we're going to do brewing, I think. We're going we're gonna to get drunk earlier on in this round. Right, question is, do I save the statue for something good? Yeah, I don't think we've got enough room on there to do the hot fields. So we'll do a hot field sort of down here. Try and make the most of the area. So we want a brewery down there. Nice. So I'm thinking if I do a sawmill there, so that covers the one on the right. And then I should be able to put a lumberjack on the left there. Decent. All right, so now our next pack. What do we go for? I think let's do a city pack. And I think we'll build the city around the statue. Right, so sit center there, right on the edge. We'll bung a mansion in the middle. House on the edge. Can I rotate this house to fit? Yes, I can. And then another mansion. Oh, that fits lovely in there. Nice, that's pretty space efficient, I think. All right, next pack. Farming or shaman? I think shaman, and we'll keep adding here. This is point central. So shaman is actually no good up there because the city center's in range. But can I squeeze it on one of these little platforms? I can put it there. That's eight. Or even up here with the... Oh, look at this. Look at this. So if I put it up here, I get 18 because we've got some flowers. Oh, I've got 21 over here. So that, 21 big, big ones. Farming or fisher? Let's try and do some fishing. We haven't really seen what this one has yet. We've got a load of buildings. We might have a house that we can squeeze on. There you go, 13 points. That's what I'm talking about. Then we got a mansion. It is all shaped. It might. Yeah, so a mansion's going up here. And then hop field, so we can add to our brewery. 15 big ones. And then a fisher. The fisher has a base score of four and it gets bonus for city centers, warehouse, statue, seaweed. Oh, it's a huge radius. I think it's only really worth putting it in range of these. So that's 13 points. I'm going to just shove that down there, I think. Nice. We may as well stay here because I don't think there's any need to go to another island yet. There's still points to be had. Ooh, a fountain. All right, so our fountain. Can it fit on this platform? Balls. Doesn't it like it can? That is disappointing because that would have been mega points. <gasps> Holy moly. 19. Yeah, okay. It's going up there. And I can add another hop field. That's 21 points right there. Banging. Then our new pack. Farming or park? Ooh. Right, so I've just got the park. Annoyingly, it doesn't fit up here. 
But uh, there would have been some mega points up there. We've got to keep them away from the lumber mill and sawmills. And that's really annoying. I'm going to guess down here is the best spot. Eight points. It's not a lot, but it's better than nothing. All right, so if I can fit one there, that's 11. I'll take that. All right, so we've got a lumberjack, but we need quite a lot of points. Yeah, I think we need 28 points. And I can't see us getting 28 wherever we put this. So I'm going to use the method I did previous round. And I'm going to press next island. Let's go. Oh wow, and this is a big island. It is huge. Is that gold? What is that? I want it. I want it. All right, so we've got lumberjack or seaweed farms. We only need to get 20 points. I can see quite a lot of trees, so I'm going to go with the lumberjacks, I think. Let's try and find a good spot. We can get 17 up there. We shall go for that. And then we'll try and get another one in a good spot. Oh, we can get 13. I think 13 is probably the best we can do. And we're up to the next rank, so that's good. And then this one, the sawmill. We'll just shove that in the middle so both are covered. 14 points in the bag. So I will just add whatever we want next. So is it farming or city? I think it might be time to do some more city. And maybe we'll go around the statue up there. So we're going to have houses down that side. Mansions down this side. Because it does look like they'll fit good. You know, I've sort of jengered them up a bit. One in there. And then the city centre... Can put this way over here so it's just touching because you don't get any extra points if the city center's in range of houses or mansions yeah so nothing on the map helps us with the hop field or the brewery so i might just choose a spot well apart from the statue of course i think i'll start my own hop what's it called a hop yard a hop vine vineyard i, d I don't know and some houses oh we got quite a thin house here fit that in there for 12 i will take that and then some mansions we can get 13 points out of it that's a pretty good day in the office if you ask me and then we've got another sawmill i might just wait and see we've got two extra levels to gain uh i think we'll do fisher i believe that helped us quite well on the first island and then we can even add more we can add oh the fountains were banging last time i'm gonna have fountains all right, so city center. I really don't want that to be in range of this. There's not a lot it wants to be in range of, to be honest. So it might be a case of just put a city center way out here on its own. <laughs> there we go. But the fountain, that does want to be in range. So look, 22 points there. Bung it there, sorted. We've got a shaman. We know these are good. So we can get 25 a lot of places. We can get 29 there because it's out of range of the other shaman. So I think that's the key. Oh look, here we go, here we go. I found the right sort of radius for it. So 35 there. There you go. Bang in. Oh, we are creaming it, guys. Absolutely creaming it. And then we've unlocked another island. So that's a good little backup. I love how chilled this game is. It's like, no pressure. Just, just crack on, Matt. Just crack on. So 15 down there. 16 down there. Right, I think mansions should go around the old city centres. Because they seem to add up the points big time. Oh, and that fits in beautifully. Right, shall we add... Let's add a park. I think the parks were pretty good last time. We got shamans and huts and all sorts. Nice. So we can get 26 for a shaman over there. So we'll do that. So I think we probably want to go over here somewhere. 14 points. That just clips the two lumber yards. So that's good. And then a park. We know a park is good in many places. Yeah, I think we'll go for 13. May as well go for the biggest. And then a brewery. If we can get a brewery over here that's not in range of that brewery. I don't know if there's anywhere. We can get 13 points up there. Yeah, if I do that. And then we'll pick one of these. So we can do a plateau. I don't know what a plateau is. Let's have a look. City centers, mansions, statues, and seaweed fields. Oh my god, it's huge. It is enormous. Oh my god. That's not going to fit anywhere. Oh, I can get it in range there. I tell you what, I might bung it there. 10 points, I'll take it. So a hut, if we can squeeze one in to use up some space. Some of these awkward spaces, 18. Yep, I'll take that. And then, oh, we got a tower. We've got to see what the tower looks like. Oh, it's huge. Down here it gets so many, 22, 30 points. <gasps> I think that is pretty good. Look at all those points. And then warehouse, we're just doing all the new buildings. This is awesome. So warehouses, it seems they want to be in range of the old sawmills. 
and the farm. It's basically everything that collects food or resources. I think we'll go for the nine. We'll go there. We got two more packs. Oh, the circus is in town. All right, so a circus doesn't want to be near mansions or temples. And there really aren't too many places for this one. Can we get any positives over here? Down there, six. Yeah, we'll do that. The circus. We've got another plateau, bollocks. <laughs> oh, he's going water. Oh, maybe I'll just bung that down there then. Sorted, another 10 points. Rank up. So a hut, 21 points. Can't say no to that. Right, gold mine. We can finally mine that gold. So yeah, over here we've got gold. So we're gonna shove that in there. We've also got jewelry. Ah, oh, so they want to be in range of mansions and the gold thing. Oh god, it's going to be negative. It's going to be negative. That could be the best score for it. Minus one. That's disappointing. Minus one. The circus. We know that's a load of arse as well. <laughs> oh god, it's getting a bit tricky now then. So we can put the circus on that edge and that's 12. And then another mansion. 12 points. Ram it in. They don't... They don't have much private space, these mansions. They're all a bit packed in, aren't they? Alright, market. Give me the market. Some houses. Nine. Ten. Then the market. Whoa, look at that. They are huge numbers. 70 points up there. 70 big ones. Damn. Oh, look at the thing go. I think that's our highest point total yet. Alright, resort oasis time. So they want to be in hop fields, plateaus, parks. Oh, so over here is pretty good. 43, because all the hop fields and stuff. But I'm going to guess over here could be even better. Oh, no. I was completely wrong. Okay, we're definitely doing that over here then. <laughs> 45. Nice. We've got a house. Our house. In the middle of our street. Our house. There aren't any streets in this game. There, tent. Another tavern! We can get boozy! Finally! Right, so we've got our thing up here. That gets us only plus three. Maybe we want to be a range of houses and stuff. Seven. Ooh, down there was a good one. Do I see... Oh, 27. Yes. Feed the people booze. And we've ranked up again. Uh, city centre. Do 15 there. 15 just on its own, it seems. So we can get a 22 down here if we put it by the sea. So I'll do that. Oh god, it's minus 75 for a temple. I don't think we're ever going to build one. Shit. I can't even find a spot for it. <laughs> okay, we'll leave the temple now. Let's wang some parks in. I think our parks are doing good over here. Yeah, 16, 13, 13. So, ooh, we can build some walls. So they want to be near temple market jewelry. Oh, I think over here. Alright, so on there's 15. I can see some big scores if we can squeeze it in here somewhere. No, we can't... Oh, we can get one there. 15. We already had 15, didn't we? Yeah, we'll bung it there. Alright. Oh, there you go. 20, 20 something. 21. Nice. Alright, 9 point fountain. I think that's the best we can do. Can we fit one more mansion on here? Yes. 9 points. Oh, we're getting close to not... Being able to do it. This is our last one. Seaweed farm or farming pack? Let's do a seaweed farm. So we've got more walls. No, these are quite good. So we get nine points there. And that takes us the next round. Phew. Right. It's our last one. A balloon. I love balloons. Oh, we've got a tower as well. <gasps> Towers are good. Oh, look, look, look. That was crazy points. Eight, 36. Oh, I think we're safe. I think we're safe. <laughs> Somehow we made it to the next level. Nice. Seaweed fields. They go down here. And then our balloon. Oh, 70 points in the middle. Yeah, so we're going above there. We're going 70 points. Boosh. Oh, now we're absolutely creaming it again. We're three... Oh, we're actually... Oh, we're nearly there. A monument. What does a monument look like? Oh, it looks cool, but it doesn't get you many points. It's very negative. What does it want to be in range of? Temple and city centres and parks. <gasps> There's a 20 there. I'm going to shove it there. Maybe up there just for six. Yeah, why not? <laughs> Got a house. Oh, we're looking not that good now. I've said that quite a few times though. So let's see what this brings us. A water plateau. Ooh. 
So it basically gets us 13. There's not a lot it does. Get a 16 there, so we'll try that. We've got another plateau. Oh, we can put that there. That's in range of both city centres. And then we can put a temple on top. Oh, no, that's minus 50 points. Oh, I can't I can't do the temple then. Let's start building a mansion around there. Oh, this could actually be the last one. A wall plateau. A wall plateau gets us 14 pretty much anywhere. 18 if I do it there. Right, so a hut. There's a good spot. 22. And then we've just up to the next level. That was close. Right, oh, there's only one to pick. There's not an option now, so farming pack it is. I think this is definitely the end. So what have we got? We've got Hopfield. They were doing well over here. 11. Not many spots for a field. Uh, I think just up there then. And then that would be our last one, but no, I'm going to go next island. <laughs> and I think this could go on forever. But uh, if you want to see the next episode, give the video a like. Let me know in the comments. Uh, and thank you to the patrons for supporting this video. Uh, quite enjoying this, it's super, super chilled. And hopefully you just enjoyed sitting back, listening to my voice, me blabbering on about nonsense. But yeah, cheers guys. Peace, love, and islands. And I'll catch you next time. Bye.